it main account time and final round of the hungarian grand prix we sit 10th at the minute four races in 129 points it's been very very tough indeed so far some really bad luck with racing not being able to overtake and monza wow first corner from 12th to p24 just absolute pinned on the outside so we arrive at imola very difficult track in the wet as all the field pit on a 4-4 and personally i'm going to try a 5-3 and just look out for tires this is just a test to see in the future if we can do it but we're about to find out we'll try a 5-3 and a 4-4 the chances are we'll just do a 4-4 if it doesn't work we'll have to try our luck with the pit stops and hopefully we don't come out plumb last because you just simply can't do a 3-5 and a 5-3. Very, very easy. So we've got a real player for Imola. And hopefully we can put in a good result for Alfa Romeo 2. So here we go. Lights out and away we go. Yuki and Hamilton both with the perfect start. Yuki getting a shove along and manages to move into P number 9. What about Hamilton? Stuck out the back as Sonoda takes P8 and P7. And Hamilton up to P14. So we've made a few little movements early on. And sat 7th and 14th. That's not too bad, but we are going to get the chaos. How's the tyres? 84% already. So it looks like five laps is just not going to be possible. It's right on the limit. And obviously we haven't done this big straight yet either. So I'm going to stick to a 4-4. Four, four. We're in a decent enough position in the field at this point. So let's try and commit now. Bit of a waste on the frost. It was worth the try, but never mind. And you can see us now closing down Esteban Ocon in P number 6. And then we're stuck behind. Can't get through. So can we get through now? Still stuck up the gearbox of Esteban Ocon just cannot make our way forward still at the moment Hamilton behind Gasly it's always the Alpine always in the way and finally Sonoda gets back through into P number 6 Hamilton makes a position in the corner he just saw up to P15 so we're doing okay it's going to come down to these look of the pit stop draw to see what happens down the straight we go Aston Martin trying to close behind us. We'll hold at bay for now. And we'll come in for the pits. We're doing the 4-4. Four, four. We've just, just got to do it. The good thing is we've got power unit left on Hamilton. And you can see it's absolute chaos around here at the moment. But we're still pushing. We're going to push now Yuki just to give us a little bit extra of a gap. We'll push Hamilton as well. And in we come. Everybody now launching into the pits. And so is Hamilton. 9%. There's no chance he would have got any further. And Sonoda, P5 by the look. We'll take that every day of the week. And we'll push as well up to P4. Hamilton, he's got away with it a little bit. P18. We'll do the pit exit trick as well. Take P17. So not too bad for Hamilton, considering he was about P16, P15 when he came in. And we're already back up now to P16. Rival P5 hasn't pitted. He's managing to just to scrape five laps. And Sonoda in a world of his own. What about Hamilton? Can we get through? We can. We can get up to P14. Yes, we can. So, some good moves here. And here's the rival in P13. Good move up the inside. Ah, oh, that usually would be our position. Not today, though. So, we're on for some okay points. Bit of a traffic jam at that point. And we're still in a traffic jam. Can't get past. No one's going to be pitting now. We've got to do this all on the track. Verstappen P13 for the rival. 
just can't get the speed to get anywhere near. But we're trying. We are trying. As Snowder comes through. It's Hamilton who's struggling today. Can we now get Verstappen? Doesn't look like it, does it? There's P3. We're closing on P3 all the time. And now we're trying to push against Verstappen. We've got to watch our tyres, though. And here's a move up the inside. Oh, wow. The rival gets the opponent, but we can't get anyone. As Sonoda comes through. And he's going to come home in P number four, Sonoda. Hamilton still stuck behind. And can only take P14. So not a great start. But we'll have to take 32 points in our first race of final round. So we've got Sonoda P12, Hamilton P20. Coming down the main straight now. Can we get any more positions? Trying hard. We're going to push now as well. Hamilton's doing okay. P21. It's not the best. Sonoda's in a traffic jam. And Hamilton's going backwards all the time. We'll pit this lap for some softs. A bit of a laggy game, this one. We're up to P10, though. Hopefully, we can survive the lag of Jeddah. And no DC. That's the last thing we need at this point. But we are P10. Earning that power unit back. And now coming into the pits. We'll boost Hamilton around the final corner. Should get some few pit stops now coming in as well. Just like so. And that's a nice big jump for Hamilton. If he can get ahead of Verstappen, he can. Sonoda losing out quite a bit. But he's now out the pits. Here's Hamilton struggling to get past. We're going to move for the soft though. Round the outside he goes into P7. So very good start to this race. Lagging again. Lagging all the time. Can we get P6 past Carlos Sainz? Trying all the time to do so. He's very, very jolty at the moment. And into the pits we come. So, very good stint by Hamilton. Here comes Sonoda as well, into P13. So, this is looking okay. And now Hamilton can just chill and earn some of that power unit back. And he's going to get ahead of the Alpha Tauri as well. Perfect. It's going to be hard tyres for Sonoda. Or it's not, actually. We're going to go for... No, I think we do go hard here. I'm going to switch up the strategy. I don't want to take another pit stop if I can help it. So this is the plan. Come into the pits this time round. 
Hamilton will continue. And he'll overtake a fair amount of cars. P11. And Sonoda comes out P14. Which is a good start for him. What about Hamilton past Hamilton into P10? Now, we will come out with some mediums to try and push this hard. You can see Sonoda doing okay. We don't even need to service, but I'm too scared to cancel the button. So we'll leave it in. Archon comes in. And we're going to do okay. We're going to come, or oh, just jump in ahead of the pack. As we come out, we can boost. See if we can get past Sonoda on the hards. Rivals pushing too. But we're doing a... Sonoda's looks good on this hard tyre. Hamilton's bang there as well. And we're all over the back of the mediums. Can we get any more places? We're going to try on Alonso. Job done. Beautiful move. And then we can boost up to P5. And we can boost for Hamilton as well. Can we get P4? Yes, we are. I thought we had him. I thought we had Gasly. And now we do. We're into P4. Hamilton into P9. This is good work. P8 for Hamilton as well. Can we just survive and get some big, big points? I think we're going to. Snowda comes around and we'll finish in P4. Hamilton chasing hard. P8 for Hamilton. And we'll absolutely take a massive 38 points and a very glitchy Jeddah. Race 7 comes from Bahrain, Sakir Desert. And what used to be a very nice track now turns into a bit of a challenge. But how many points? That's the key question. 13th and 19th we start. And I'm going to do a Cuppa. And I'm going to do a... Ch well, let's do the same Cuppa again. Let's try and get these on a 3-3-2. Free, free Hopefully, we'll split out enough on the gap. Sonoda should get a perfect start anyway. But let's have a look. Hopefully, he doesn't get pinned at the first corner. Fast start for Sonoda. <clears throat> and here we go, into that first corner. Round the outside, nearly gets spun around. But P10 it is. And we're still on the outside. And both of these now, absolutely losing places. Can we get snow to an extra place? We can. P11 and P10. Hamilton's gone backwards in P14. We're going to still push Sonoda though. As we try and get into P number 8. So Alonso looking pretty slow out there. Can we do a move? Well, he suddenly, suddenly found some pace. We're going to push through this middle section. Alonso holding up the field. Not any longer. We're through. We're going to try and close with Hamilton as well. Move Sonoda back up to medium boost to close the gap. You can see Hamilton there as well. Hard tyres ahead. Not anymore. P13. We will then pit. Sonoda. We'll try and push him this little bit. See if we can gain him a little bit more of a gap. We can get him up to P7. And now right behind P6. 
Whereas Hamilton is only P13. So we shouldn't be able to stack here. It should be pretty good. And it is. Some nice bit of air. As Archon just gets us Alpine again. Always just finding a way. To get past us. But we're doing okay. P20 now for Hamilton. And we've got the hard tyre of Sonoda ahead. Can we get him on the home straight? Doing a 4-4. Should now get him. We do. He's doing a 5-3, in fact. As Hamilton moves himself up to P17. I'm going to boost him a little bit as well. Let's boost. Try and get past Sonoda. Job done. Nice and easy. Hamilton makes it easy as well. P14 and P8. Gradually moving forward. So, one more in the pit. And these two separated by just enough, by the look of it. See if we can get past the Ferrari, holding us up as well. Past one. Can we get past two? We can. And now P5. What's the gap? It's enough. We've got good power unit on Hamilton as well. Who comes in? And Sonoda is going to come out in some nice clean air. P9. Hamilton P14. How many places can we make though? We've got one pit in ahead at least. That's good. We've got Sonoda again in front. So we'll just look after the power unit. Down the straight. And now P6, P11, can we get any further? Sonoda's chasing the two Ferraris down. Hamilton chasing the Haas. And we've got a breakdown as well. Can we chase the Ferraris? We're catching on very quickly. Not quick enough though. Or do we get signed? No, we can't. P6... Lewis Hamilton will come home to take P9 as well. So it is a solid 35 points in Bahrain. Race 8 sees us return to Hungary for the final race of final round. It's going to be a tough one. We got 35 points in the first race. Can we counteract and score a few more? Sonoda P13 and Hamilton P19. We're going to do the same again and hope we can squeeze it. We're going to use Frost on Sonoda. And then Hamilton is going to go for the... I'm going to use Herald. Let's try Herald and see if we can just scrape a better start. So, Sonoda on the outside. Will that cause us some pain? No perfect start, but he gets a good start. P12, and now he falls back, goes around the outside, and up to P number 9. So that's not too bad. P8, P11. Can we get the Ferrari? Oh no, we can lose a position instead. P9, P10. Definitely looking at a 3 5 here. As we try and get through, and it's all a bit chaos still. Down the straight we go. Lap one done. What have we got ahead of us? Hards and mediums. So we're going to want to get past these. 
Can we have a little push? We can, up to P8. Hamilton P10 at the moment, up to P7. So hopefully we can do the undercut on Hamilton and get him through. But at the minute, P7 for Sonoda. Bang on to the four laps. Hamilton will bring in this lap on the hards. But Snowder's looking good in P7. We'll boost Hamilton a little bit more. See if we can get him through. We can't. As we come in to the pits. Snowder carries on. And we'll come in for the mediums at the end of this run. And Hamilton comes out P14. Or even P15 now. So that looks good for an undercut. And hopefully we can do the same with Sonoda. Who will come in. So a big few laps to come. On this one. Sonoda coming out. Down in P12. Comes out ahead of Hamilton. And we'll push now to try and close the gap. Got Russell and the Alfa Romeo ahead of him. We're past Russell now. So into P11. Hamilton was still pushing as well. A few more cars coming into the pits. Which we'll see us take in to P number 9. And Hamilton up to P11. Many more to pit ahead of us. A couple of hard tyres. So we'll continue pushing along. And now we've got a big train of cars ahead of us. Can we make a jump past? There'll be a couple of people pit. And there's one. As we nearly get past Lance Stroll. But P7, P8. And a total of 35 again at the moment. I think we can definitely get Stroll before the end of this. As we approach the final lap. Can we dive through the first corner? Two cars there. We've got Stroll. Now we got the inside. If we can get him, can we get Magnussen as well? Into P5. Yes, we can at the minute. And can we get one more? Can we get Charles Leclerc? We're into P4. And we're going to bring home P4 and P... Oh, nearly 7. Well, it's going to be 38 points in the final race. So that is 272 points from 8 races in a final round. An improvement from yesterday where we only scored 2, 6, 3. So fingers crossed that will be enough for potentially P1. But we'll wait and see until everyone else is finished. And fingers crossed for rewards will be pretty decent as well.